well, 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 looks like Sony is in quite a pickle right now. So the short of it is they got hit with a ransomware attack and Insomniac stuff has leaked. Now, they're working on this new unannounced game. They have pictures of the Wolverine game. And what we're looking at right now is a picture of the Wolverine game because that's what's important to this conversation. Now, the problem is it really does look like it might be a God of War clone or... To be more apt, it would be uh, more like along the lines of Ratchet and Clank, which would be kind of like a hub or quasi open world game with a lot of linear segments, which wouldn't be a bad game. I'm not going to dunk on it for like that. But when you're expecting an open world game along the lines of Spider Man, when you're saying, like, hey, this game's going to take place in the same world as Spider Man, and so everyone's thinking, oh, cool, we're going to get this really sweet open world. Wolverine game, and then you drop a like, game that's more along the lines of Ratchet and Clank, there's going to be uh, some very noticeable disappointment amongst online communities. Especially, and now I'm going to do a bit of console war here. <laughs> Not really, dude. Guys, back in the day, console war used to be about arguing between like your favorite sports team. Now it's like two cults fighting each other. The internet has made it unfun. But if you look at Xbox, they have an exclusive Blade game made by Arcane. Now, I don't have a lot of faith in Arcane. They haven't really, their quality's been on the steady decline since Dishonored 1. They have their fans and defenders, but really, they have not wowed me in quite a long time. And there's no real ant beyond the ant. They just haven't wowed me in a long time. So I don't have a lot of faith in this Blade game, especially after Redfall. But. It might be good, maybe. Who knows? I'm not going to write that game off because especially when Matt Booty is now in charge and we don't know how significant the reforms at ZeniMax are going to be. So wouldn't be smart to write that game off either. But it will likely be open world. Compare and contrast, you have this sweet open world Blade game where you're fighting vampires and hopefully with better AI and none of the downfalls of Redfall versus a quasi-open, quasi-linear Wolverine game from Sony who's already been accused of not having a diversity amongst their play styles, that's not going to compare and contrast well. So Sony and the fandom is kind of a really bad spot, and really that's kind of why Jim ESG Ryan got the boot. And hopefully with uh, people in Japan taking over, you know, we'll get some back to some good old PlayStation. And that's all I have to say about that. Y'all have a great day. Peace out.